Get ready to see some players who have been charged with a crime. Welcome to Athletic Prime Stars. Trust us, you wouldn't have even thought about it. We can say that some of the most admired people in the world are soccer players. It's simple to lose sight of the fact that players are still people and are undoubtedly capable of making mistakes that could lead to a legal issue. Soccer players are now recognized around the world because of social media. Their personal lives are currently in the spotlight instead of their accomplishments on the field. The people who play soccer have become role models for many due to the media's extensive coverage of every part of their lives. Nonetheless, a select few athletes have occasionally made headlines for the wrong reasons, suffering punishments for criminal offenses or even going to jail. There are many crimes committed by soccer players, but let's take a look at 12 players who have served prison terms after considering everything. Number 1. Bruno Fernandes de Souza Bruno Fernandes, who won the Brazilian Serie A championship with Flamengo, was responsible for one of the most heinous crimes. A lengthy term of incarceration was imposed upon him by the judicial system. In July of 2010, he was formally charged with murder, kidnapping, concealing a body, organizing a criminal gang, which is a conspiracy, and corrupting juveniles. All of these charges were brought against him. After some time, Bruno admitted that he had been the mastermind behind the scheme. On March 8th of 2013, the judge handed him a sentence of 22 years in prison for assault, torture, and murder of his ex-girlfriend, who was also the mother of his youngest child. Bruno was released from jail in July of 2019 to participate in a semi-open program for the remainder of his term. In this program, he would be subject to home arrest at night, but would be allowed to work or train during the day. Number 2. Benjamin Mendy Benjamin Mendy, who played for the Manchester City and won the Premier League on many occasions, was arrested in 2021 and charged with seven separate accounts of rape and sexual assault. The Frenchman was given a prison sentence to serve at HMP Alt Course near Liverpool. Still, due to his concerns for his safety, he was transferred to a maximum security facility known as HMP Manchester before the holiday season of 2021. Afterwards, Mendy was granted bail, but he was subject to several stringent conditions and he is scheduled to stand trial for the allegations he faces at the end of January 2022. Number 3. Rene Aguita The goalie, who became famous and well-known around the soccer world for his fantastic scorpion kick clearance during a match between England and Colombia, found himself in the heart of some shady business in the 1990s. The game in question took place in England and Colombia. Because of his role in a kidnapping that also featured the notorious drug lord Pablo Escobar, the Colombian footballer was sentenced to jail for his involvement in the crime. Even though Higuita's only responsibility was to deliver the money, the offense resulted in him doing seven months in Bogota jail. Number 4. Adam Johnson Adam Johnson is a character who stirs up quite a bit of controversy despite having won the Premier League with Manchester City. In 2016, while he was still playing for Sunderland, he was found guilty of child sex offences by the court. The former England international was immediately fired from his position with the Black Cats. 2019 marked the year that Johnson was finally eligible for release from jail after having served three years and three months of his six-year term. Number 5. Ronald Inho because of his involvement in the false passport scandal in the year 2020, Ronald Dinho, who is widely regarded as the greatest soccer player of all time, was sentenced to serve five months in a correctional facility. The court found the Brazilian soccer player guilty of faking passport paperwork while traveling to Paraguay in 2020. With his brother, Roberto de Assis, he was given a prison term of five years for their involvement in the crime. On the other hand, a plea bargain was presented to the two of them, which would shorten their sentence to five months and require them to pay a total of a $200,000 fine. Both men spent their sentences in the same facility in Asuncion, and during their time there, Ronaldinho even managed to celebrate his 40th birthday behind bars. Have you been surprised yet? Well, if you haven't, then wait until the end of the video to know the names it will surprise you even more. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our channel, Athletic Prime Stars, for much more unique content. Number 6. Ian Wright Ian Wright, who was only 19 years old at the time, served time in juvenile detention and became one of the best strikers in the history of the Premier League. The legendary member of the Arsenal Football Club was sentenced to two weeks in Chelmsford Prison in 1982 after he refused to pay for the insurance or taxes on his two autos. Wright was frequently emphasized the significance of the sentence in his life and how it influenced him for the better, even though it was just a short one. Quote, well, I did say that I would never return to a location like that again. I was aware that I needed to begin following societal's conventional wisdom and norms. End quote. In 2016, Wright remarked that that was it. Number 7. George Best 
George Best was not only one of the best players in the history of Manchester United and Northern Ireland, but also involved in his fair share of controversy off the field. The soccer player was sentenced to serve some time in jail in 1984 after being found guilty of driving after drinking alcohol, assaulting a police officer, and failing to answer bail. As a result of these convictions, he had to serve some time behind bars. After being found guilty, the judge sentenced Best to three months in prison and he ended up spending Christmas at Ford Open Prison while serving his time. Number 8. Tony Adams Adams is widely considered to be one of his generation's most talented soccer players. His whole 19-year professional career was spent with Arsenal. Throughout his time as an England centre-back, he struggled with drinking on and off. In December of 1990, he was also given a prison sentence of four months. Yet, he was granted an early release in February. The former captain of Arsenal was taken into custody once more after his vehicle collided with a wall close to his residence. After being tested, it was discovered that he had 27 times the legal amount of alcohol in his system. Number 9. Joey Barton Joey Barton was frequently involved in contentious exchanges with teammates and opponents on the field. In addition, he got himself embroiled in several occurrences outside of it. The England international has already been convicted of violent acts and served time in prison for both instances. The first two occurred when he hit a pedestrian with an automobile while driving in the center of Liverpool. As a result, he was found guilty of assault by the judge and sentenced to 77 days in prison. In addition to serving this term, Barton was barred from playing football for four months. He admitted to assaulting his former teammate Alsmain Darbo while playing for Manchester City. Number 10. Duncan Ferguson Duncan Ferguson is regarded as one of the best attackers in Scotland's history, and his exploits with Everton earned him a lot of fame. Despite this, he was involved in multiple brawls outside of the game. He was four convictions for assault, one of which was for headbutting Wraith Rovers defender John McStay in 1994. The other three convictions were for different types of assault. Number 11. Diego Maradona a history of criminal behavior is a mystery surrounding one of the untouchable game icons who has ever graced a soccer field. Maradona was suspended for 15 months in 1991 after a positive test for cocaine was conducted on him while playing for Napoli. After failing a drug test for ephedrine in 1994 at the World Cup held in the United States, he was kicked out of the tournament and banned for additional 15 months due to the incident. In the same year, he was detained for firing an air weapon at journalists, and he was subsequently found guilty of this offense in 1998. And at number 12, Marlon King. Marlon King is possibly the player with the most issues out of everyone on the list. According to The Guardian, he has been charged with 13 crimes seven times. Yet, just one of these led to a sentence of imprisonment being handed out. In 2002, the former Watford striker was found guilty of receiving a stolen BMW worth £30,000 and was sentenced to prison for 18 months. However, his sentence was later reduced to nine months after an appeal was successful. Let's just hope today soccer players don't get accused of these things because we're very fond of them, right? Well, now that that topic has ended, you must have understood these criminal names in the soccer industry. If you liked the video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel, Athletic Prime Stars, for further updates. Also, check out our YouTube channel for more exciting videos like these. Tell us how it went, and if you have any suggestions, please include them in the comment box below. We're really interested in hearing what you expect from our content. Thank you for joining, and we'll see you next time.